Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a 10 minute circuit to work on our glutes. For this circuit, you can use a band or no equipment at all, okay? No stress. I have my timer here. We're going to work on 45 seconds with 15 seconds rest, okay? First exercise, we're gonna put the band around the thighs, okay? And go into a quadruped position. Once you're here, it helps to put the knee on top of the band to help us secure. And let's start this thing. Extend your one leg behind and we go here with the leg up and down. The reason why we have the band in here is because it helps stay still. If you keep the band around your thigh, it will come all the way up to your hips, okay? All right, so here we squeeze the glute, keep the ribs to hips and your neck long. Very important to work on the glute muscles with Pilates. We don't focus on a butt lift. We focus on strengthening the right muscles to help the other muscles relieve. For example, your lower back. Sometimes lower back issues come because we have a weak glute or a weak core so this workout is to help you with that all right we go with the other side now we change to the other knee keep the band in there checking that your knee is exactly on their hip and we take that leg up and down notice that here I'm not focused on lifting too much that's not the goal the goal is to activate your glute max okay the big one. Good, keep your core tight. That's it. Softening your elbows here. Lift your upper back. Don't let the shoulder or the chest go down. Lift. We're almost there. Good. Abdominals engage. Five seconds left, squeeze, 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 squeeze. All right, now we put the band here around the thigh muscles, lay it on our back, just above your knees. Keep your feet hip width apart, away from your buttocks, palms are facing up. We're going with a glute bridge in here. One vertebrae at a time. Hold the buttocks at the top, open, close, and slowly lower. And again, up, core tight, open, close, and slowly lower. When you're doing the opening here at the top, you don't have to open much and don't let the pelvis drop, okay? You wanna keep it up, even, open, close, and then we go down, okay? It's a slow movement. Because we have the eyes up, we can also check that the thighs are parallel and that you open the legs evenly, not one more than the other, okay? Even. Rest, rocking the knees here from one side to the other. We're going up again back into our quadruped, pressing the band with one knee, elbows on the shoulders, keep your knee bent and your ankle flex, not arching, tucking the tailbone under. We do a horse kick again. This time with the knee bend, up and down. You can take the band off anytime if it's too much. When you buy the bands, they normally come in packs with uh, different levels of resistance. So choose the one that suits you best, okay? Don't force it. Start from the beginning and from there you build up. Elbows on the shoulders here. I'm feeling my butt working. <laughs> Good. Abdominals engage. Three, two, one, and we rest. Okay, changing again. Hold the band here with your knee. Elbows on the shoulders, knee on the hip, ankle is flexed. We take that leg up and down, okay? Checking that we're not arching the back. You have to keep it strong. Abdominals engage. Fix that here. Good. That's it. Also, don't let your chest go down to shoulder sink. 
press the upper back. Keep your knee bent and the ankle flex. Keep the abdominal contraction and the teeth on tight. We have 15 seconds left. Also, there is no need to look at the knee. 20 kilos extra you're putting here in your cervical spine. Keep your neck aligned with your back. Last one. Okay. We go again with the band around the thighs, just above the knees. Lay on your side, we're gonna do clamps. Heels align with the buttocks. Legs in a big shape, neck is resting on the shoulder. Push the top hip away over time and we lift the leg. Squeeze the heels together. Squeeze your glutes, of course. Simple plan. Very good exercise to help us strengthen the hips, the lower back. When the glutes are working right, then you can start to release that overwork from all the other areas of your body. I always say that you really have to recommend, or sorry, you really have to check with a professional if you've been going with hip pain or back pain for a long time. All right, and we rest. Let's go with the other side. Same thing. Check the setup here. Heels aligned, hips stuck. Head is resting on the shoulders. Always we check up with the setup first, and then we start the exercise. It doesn't matter if it takes you more time. It's better to do it right than to do many repetitions wrong. Keep your shoulder relax. Also here, check that the top hip is not moving, okay? Imagine that you have a wall behind you. Squeeze your glutes. This is one of my favorite exercises to work on the glute meat, the glute max. We love and hate this exercise. <laughs> Give your core tight. All right, we're going back with the first side, keeping your band exactly where it is. Bottom leg is bent, top leg is extended, head is resting on the shoulder, the setup is the same, gap between the waist and the mat. Bring that leg up, we're gonna draw circles. One, two, keep your hips stuck, three, four is more, small circle, reverse, five, four, three, two, four tight, one, in again. Keep your shoulder relaxed. It's a small circle. If you go bigger, then you're gonna move the whole body, okay? It's a small circle. Change the direction. Good. Change again. Relax your shoulders here. From the chest down, everything is working. From the chest up, everything is relaxed. Let's go on the other side. Same setup again. Bottom knee is bent, top leg is extend, punching toes, gap, core tight, circle. Change the direction. Good. We're almost done. 10 minutes very quickly. And we're gonna stretch the glutes and the hips at the end. And if you wanna follow this workout with an abdominal or a leg work, check out the links below. Oh, ah, I forgot to say, change the direction. <laughs> Each five, we change the direction. Almost there, still, Babix is working hard. It's burning. <laughs> All right, we have one more exercise here. Put the band around your ankles. We're going now with the stomach on the mat. Separate here your legs in a V shape. It's a really small V. Squeeze your glute. Tucking the pubic bone on the mat. We want to bring the legs up, stretch, and then down. Up, open, close, and down. Up, open, 
close and down. Notice that because this is the last exercise, I'm not able to lift that much, but that's not important. What's important here is that you tuck the pubic bone on the mat and keep the belly button towards the spine to lengthen the back muscles. Keep going, squeezing the glutes, bring the legs up, stretch, gonna feel it here on the side and down. Forehead is resting on the mat. And we rest now. Okay, fun is off. Ah, that was tough. Okay, we are going here into what I call the four. Ankle over thigh, pushing this knee away. Two options here. You can push the knee away with the hand, or you can reach through and draw the knee in. Relax your shoulders. We can rock here from one side to the other. Always when we're stretching, we breathe in through the nose and out through the nose. I always say this in my classes to help people relax. Feel the stretch. Let's swap leg. Choose the option. You might, you might notice that with one side you're tighter than the other, so don't push it. All right, just let it be. If it's this option, by all means, take it. If you feel too comfortable, let's go for the next one. You can feel relaxed, your shoulders relax. Let the breath flow in and out of you and with ease through your nose and out through your nose. Rock. All right, hugging the knees in with each hand on each shin and we're gonna draw circles here in our knees, one direction, and then the other direction, relaxing the lower back. Good. I hope you felt got the burn. All right, and now coming into seated position, and we are done. 10 minutes for your glutes to help you strengthen those muscles that are the strongest muscle in your body, so we really have to take care of those. Subscribe, leave me a thumbs up, and that's it.